Hi viewers, I welcome you all for one more interesting session. This lecture is about the aircraft nationality and registration marks. An aircraft registration is a code unique to a single aircraft required by international convention to be marked on the exterior of every civil aircraft. The registration indicates the aircraft country of registration and function must like a automobile license plate. The aircraft registration consists of two parts. A prefix, which is one or two character alphanumeric code indicating nationality, and a registration suffix of one to five character. Prefix codes are based upon radio call signs allotted by International Telecommunication Union to each state. This code must also appear in its certificate of aircraft registration, which is issued by the relevant civil aviation authority. An aircraft can have only one registration in one jurisdiction, though it is changeable over the life of the aircraft. The Article 20 of the Convention requires that all aircraft to be registered and to carry a nationality mark and a registration mark. Annex 7 of the Chicago Convention covers aircraft nationality and registration marks. The annex contains only standards without any recommendations. Article 17 of the Convention says aircraft have the nationality of the state in which they are registered. As per Article 20 of the Convention, every aircraft engaged in international air navigation shall bear its appropriate nationality and registration marks. As per Article 37, ICAO is responsible agency for adopting uniform international practices and procedures and any amendment to these for dealing with registration and identification of aircraft. Now we will discuss about the regulations related with the nationality and registration marks. No person may operate a civil aircraft registered in state unless the aircraft displays nationality and registration marks. The letter used to identify the aircraft nationality shall conform to the standard outlined in ICAO Annex 7. The nationality mark, which is a prefix one or two character alphanumeric code, shall be followed by a registration mark, which is a suffix one to five character, which is assigned by the director of the registry. So here, tail number is given as Golf Kilo Eco Lima Sera. Golf is the nationality mark. It is allotted by International Telecommunication Union to United Kingdom. And Kilo Eco Lima Sera is the registration mark. When the first character of a registration mark is a letter, so in our example, it is golf, it's a letter. So it shall be preceded by a hyphen. So here, the number is, tail number is golf hyphen Kilo Eco Lima Sera. The nationality mark shall be selected from the series of nationality symbols included in radio call signs allocated to the state of registry by International Telecommunication Union. The aircraft registration consists of two parts, prefix, which is nationality, and suffix, which is registration. These are prefixes which represents nationality, like Number nine is allotted to US nation. Golf letter is allotted to United Kingdom. Victor Tango, two letters allotted to India. Nanar Mike, two alphanumeric character allotted to Malaysia. The nationality mark shall be notified to the International Civil Aviation Organization. As we have already discussed, the aircraft registration consists of two parts. A prefix, which is one or two character alphanumeric code indicating nationality and a registration suffix of one to five character. So International Telecommunication Union allots call sign to states. International call sign series can be obtained from 
International Telecommunication Union website. Canada is allotted call sign series Victor XA Alpha to Victor Zulu Alpha and so on. India is allotted various call sign series Victor Tango Alpha, Victor Whiskey Zulu Alpha, 8 Tango Alpha and so on. Australia, Victor Zulu Alpha, Alpha X-ray Alpha, Alpha X-ray Zulu. But all combinations are not permitted as it may result in confusion during search and rescue task. Letters which we cannot be used for registration mark are five letter international code of signals such as Alpha, Bravo, Tango, Hotel, India, Romeo. Other which are not permitted are distress signal like SOS and similar urgent signals like PAN, Tango, 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 Triple T, XXX. These are also not permitted. Three letter combinations beginning with Q, which are used in the Q code, also cannot be used for the registration mark. Now we will discuss about the location where registration marks to be placed on aircraft. Registration mark shall be painted on the aircraft or shall be affixed by any other means, ensuring a similar degree of permanence. The marks shall be legible and kept clean and visible at all times. Marks shall not have any ornamentation. Registration marks shall be contrast in color with the background. Size of mark for heavier than air aircraft, if the mark is on wings, height should be at least 50 centimeters. Size of mark for heavier than aircraft, if mark on fuseless and vertical tail structure, height should be at least 30 centimeters. Size of mark for lighter than air aircraft, minimum 50 centimeter height. Size of height for lighter than air other than unmanned balloons, minimum 50 centimeter height. Size of mark for lighter than air unmanned balloons. Suppose it is not of sufficient size to accommodate marks at least 50 centimeters high. Then the appropriate authority such as director of registry shall determine the size of mark taking into the account the size of payload. Size of mark as discussed for wings, height is 50 centimeter and if the mark is on other vertical surface or at fuseless surface, it should be of minimum height of 30 centimeter. The character shall be two third as wide as they are high. Exception to width for letter I and number one, which shall be one sixth as wide as they are high. The thickness of the lines shall be one sixth of the height of the character. The space between character shall be at least one fourth of a character width where the character itself is two third of the height. An aircraft shall carry an identification plate inscribed with at least its nationality and registration mark. The plate shall be made of fireproof metal or other fireproof material of suitable physical properties. For unmanned free balloon, identification plate is affixed conspicuously to the exterior of the payload. For remotely piloted aircraft, identification plate is located at prominent position near the main entrance or compartment or to the exterior of the aircraft. Certificate of registration is an official document certifying that the state of registry has registered an aircraft. The certificate is to be carried in the aircraft at all times. The certificate of aircraft registration contains aircraft registration, which is nationality. Here, Hotel Bravo is uh, allotted to Switzerland. 
an X-ray Yankee Zulu is the registration mark. Then serial number of the aircraft. Then manufacturer's designation of the aircraft, name and address of the owner. A certificate that it has been entered on the register of the state. Dated signature of the registering officer. Please like and subscribe and press the bell icon to get new video updates.